Chicago. Have you ever dreamed of creating your own mod that rivals the most famous ones like Mental Omega, Rise of the East, or Final War? If so, you're in the right place. In this video, you'll learn step by step how to set up your mod on the C in a CNET client. Start your journey into the world of modding, unleash your creativity, and become part of the amazing modding community. Let's get started. Subscribe. CNC Net is a platform designed for developing and launching new mods for Command and Conquer games. It provides tools and a community for modders to create custom content and enhance gameplay. In this video, I will guide you through the essential steps to set up your mod on the CNC Net client, making it easier for you to bring your creative vision to life. The first step is to create a new folder to serve as the base for your mod. Place all the necessary files for the mod directly in this folder without creating subfolders. Next, copy the essential game and client files into this folder. Now let's add the Ares and Phobos tools, which extend the game's features. Place both tools in the mod folder. These tools enable additional features, so ensure they are correctly placed. If they require additional setup, configure them as needed. The next step is to modify the core configuration files that control the mod settings. Open the game collection config.ini and client definitions.ini files and update the short name for the mod, Windows settings, and IRC channel. Once you've made the changes, save the files to match your mod requirements. Now that the setup is complete, it's time to test the client and run the mod. Open the client and confirm that the changes are working as expected. If you encounter any issues, recheck the modified files and settings. And with that, your mod setup is complete. Now that we've completed setting up your mod, 
Make sure to save all additional game files such as SHP, Voxel, WAV, etc. within mix files to ensure they function correctly. Subscribe. Description below.